Okay, so I am sat here with two of the four Wiggles, the rest of them are out having fun somewhere. And welcome to Lockie, and also welcome to Sahai, and uh, welcome to New Zealand, Sahai. Tell me what you thought of it so far. Well, we just landed last night, and already the people have all been so lovely, and I can't wait to explore as we go along with the tour, but so far I'm, I'm enjoying New Zealand. <laughs> finger, mommy, finger, where are you? Here I am. How's the experience been of having the new Wiggle in? And it's been nearly a year since you've been appointed the role. Um, how have you found it from your point of view, Lucky? Oh, the song has been absolutely wonderful. It's it's quite. I said to a few people, it's a when we started, the or we didn't know what to expect. But you, it takes quite a long time to really get the understanding of how to talk to children, uh, how to be yourself. It's one of the hardest things to do on stage to actually let your barriers down and be yourself. Children are very intense critics as well. There's no there's no fooling a child, right? There, there isn't. They will turn away if they don't like the song or, or they'll go back and get a snack from mum or dad. But no, Sahai's just found that really naturally, really quickly, which we all think is really quite impressive. Hello Wiggle and the first kind of uh, the time doing it. What was going through your mind? Um, I think my first performance as Yellow Wiggle was one of the carols in the Domain concert for Christmas. And that was surreal because I grew up watching that as a tradition every year. And the Wiggles were always a huge part of my life. So, And to wear yellow as well, which is my favourite colour, was absolutely surreal. And I was just thinking, like, this is a dream come true. There was a little bit of a backlash when you were announced, obviously, because Emma Wiggles always been a lot of people's favourite. I think when it was going to be announced, I only found out I was going to be Yellow Wiggle the day before it was announced. So it was a very big, like, it was a blur, which is... For me, good, because I didn't have to think about anything. I knew how big Emma was and how, how many people loved her. So I was like, this is going to be a sad day for a lot of people. So I was expecting way more criticism or like, you know, it's, I mean, it's the Wiggles. You've grown up with certain people. So some people don't enjoy change. But once I, it was announced, I got an overwhelming feedback of support and love, which I didn't expect. Like, um, so it was a lot better than I thought because I was already prepared for like, oh, look, some people won't like this. If people like me, if they don't, I, I don't really mind. It's the kids that I want to inspire and uh, just help them find love.